Right now, the seas are quiet, the skies are empty, and our roads less traveled. But it's only a matter of time before the world starts moving again. And when it does, there is one source to count on for all your travel needs. We are Expedia Cruises, and we are more than just cruise vacations. Whether it's custom vacation packages, tours, all-inclusive resorts, or flights, hotels, and activities, we are here to plan, book, and safeguard every leg of your journey. Visit ExpediaCruises.com and we will help you secure your travel by phone, online, or at an Expedia Cruises location in your neighborhood, where you can get the advice you seek, no matter what your dream vacation might be, air, land, or sea. Expedia Cruises, air, land, and sea vacations. Hello everyone and welcome to our Spotlight on Celebrity Cruises event. We are so thrilled that you spent, uh, decided to spend some time with us today and hear all about the developments happening in the cruise industry and specifically from one of our very, very top partners, Celebrity Cruises. We've got a big crew here uh, with lots of information and we're excited uh, to share things with you. So let's, let's get straight to it. Next slide, please. Uh, before we get going, uh, there's a little bit of housekeeping we like to do to make your, uh, make your event uh, more seamless. Um, sometimes technology can, can have little issues. If, if you find you're having sound issues or video issues, we highly recommend just uh, disconnect and re-log in. Very often that'll reset things and make it making it work well for you. At the very top of your screen, there's a view options uh, icon there. If you'd like to shrink the people, some of us, and see more about uh, the beautiful travel imagery and information on celebrity, you can uh, mess with that toggle or adjust that toggle and you'll find that uh, you can uh, see things in a different perspective. Um, most importantly uh, for today's uh, show is that we're here to answer your questions. We have experts from Celebrity and Expedia Cruises standing by to answer your questions about cruising and we encourage you to pop them into the Q&A box. We do our very best to answer all the questions uh, in the session live, but of course you have your professional Expedia Cruises vacation consultant at the ready to answer anything you need and to follow up with you after the event to, um, to hear what you thought and what you're thinking about your next vacation. And lastly, uh, if you like what you see, you might want to revisit it or, uh, you know, even, we would love it if you would uh, send it off to someone you're thinking of traveling with it. So this event will be recorded and we'll make that available to you after the show. Next slide, please. Um, before we uh, go any further, I should stop and introduce myself. My name is John Mast. I've been leading uh, the cruise line of business marketing uh, with Expedia Group and Expedia Cruises uh, for, believe it or not, uh, just over 20 years. I'm a passionate traveler. I love this business. I'm so excited to see what's happening on earth. We've all spent some time uh, doing less and going uh, far less uh, in terms of travel, and, and that's unlocking now. So we are here uh, to uh, unveil a little bit of work that we've been doing uh, during uh, the downturn, um, which was uh, rebrand our organization. Those of you who have known us for a long time, I'm sure knew us as Expedia Cruise Ship Centers. Today, we're proud uh, to go to market as Expedia Cruises, Airland and Sea Vacations. And the reason behind that is that we truly are a full service leisure travel agency. We can get you from door to door in style with exceptional service all the way. I like to say that uh, our brand promise here is, uh, is really, I call it the service sandwich. It begins with advice you can trust and we're with you every step of the way as you book your trips. And then of course, through the power of Expedia, we have Expedia Extras, the best choice in prices. And again, we can get you the transfers to the airport, the flights, the hotels, of course, the cruise and everything you need to have an absolutely exceptional vacation. So when you're ready uh, to start planning travel, we are here to help. And uh, my advice is that you uh, you reach out sooner than later. We are seeing incredible resurgence uh, in demand uh, and bookings. 2022 is selling extremely well. Uh, the last half of 21 is, is selling very well. And uh, very exciting news just came down the pipe uh, this week is that the very brand we have uh, here today to share their expertise with you will be sailing in June in the Caribbean and in Greece in Europe. And those are opportunities for you to cruise much sooner than later. So next slide, please. Um, to round out our story about Expedia Cruises before we pass things on to, uh, to Celebrity, 
Um, I would just like to uh, let you know that obviously times are different now. Uh, we began as a retail uh, travel agency, but we've evolved dramatically over the years. And we like to think of ourselves as a full 360 degree service uh, organization. We will meet you where you're most comfortable, over the phone, in person, via text, whatever you like, we're there to serve you and we will do uh, everything we can to uh, get you the very best value and the highest service on what you're looking for. And uh, part of our special truth, uh, next slide please, is that we are in your communities. And, and what that means is we have local expertise. Not only were we part of the community out there with you uh, in the neighborhoods, but we have the local expertise to even make your planning even that more seamless. If you're based in Boston or New York or Ontario or Vancouver or in the middle of North America somewhere, we have stores in your neighborhood. And if you're planning a trip to Europe out of Boston, the people that work in our Boston uh, location can get you the very best advice on how to get out to Boston, to Venice, where your cruise might be beginning or better yet, Greece in this case. So make sure that you're staying close to us. We'll stay close to you. And uh, I think next slide, please. We're going to pass it over to uh, Alan and the experts at Expedia Cruises, uh, pardon me, at Celebrity Cruises <laughs> to, to give you all the latest and greatest information on what's happening uh, in the world of celebrity. So with that, I'll pass it over to you, Alan. Thank you. Thanks very much, John. I hope everyone can hear me okay. Um, so yes, we're thrilled to be presenting all the new and exciting enhancements for you today. My name is Alan Brooks. I am a Director of Sales for Celebrity Cruises here in Canada. I know we have uh, lots of Canadians and some of our friends from the South, but it's the South and the States. So welcome to uh, everyone for joining us today. It's kind of our power hour. Myself and the, uh, my entire sales team here in Canada are going to be covering all of the hot topics. Uh, you may or may not have heard, but we announced last week our first ship returning back to service, the Celebrity Millennium out of St. Martin. So very, very exciting for us. Uh, we can stop dreaming and start planning now. And then just as recently as today, we announced our brand new ship. She has yet to have guests on her. She hasn't even been inaugurated, but the Celebrity Apex, the second of our Edge series ships, uh, will be sailing out of Greece. So we are well aware that for our Canadian guests out there that we still have a lot of hurdles to uh, overcome before uh, we start traveling again with border restrictions and, and testing and uh, quarantines and, and it's kind of layer upon layer, but we're going to get there. And this is a time to plan, whether it be for the end of this year or into 2022, we've got some amazing itineraries and beautiful ships that we're going to show you all today. Having said that, over 350,000 guests have sailed safely aboard cruise ships, and of that, 100,000 have sailed part of the Royal Caribbean Group, which, uh, of course, is our Royal Caribbean celebrity ships, Azamara. And so we're very proud of that with very few cases and little impact uh, to the other guests on board the ship. So a lot of planning behind the scenes, and it continues to... Uh, to happen and develop an update. And we'll share a little bit of that with you in just a moment. Also, before I continue, I do want to thank uh, our Expedia Cruises travel partners. Um, these are your travel agents, the ones uh, that have invited you here today. We have worked with them uh, throughout this pause, throughout the pandemic, uh, a very difficult year for us, but they have remained engaged. They are the most uh, updated and knowledgeable group uh, with all of the updates, and there have been many over the past year, I'm sure that you've worked with them in, in sort of working with future cruise credits and planning your next vacation, but we cannot thank our travel partners at Expedia enough for uh, sticking by us throughout this, and, and we're certainly close to uh, the finish line here. Also, we know online today we have our uh, loyal guests, our celebrity uh, our Captain's Club members, so thank you for joining us, and we're certainly excited to have you back on board. For those of you that are new to Celebrity, I know you may have cruised on another line before and you heard about us. Um, we have definitely reinvented ourselves into a new luxury platform. Um, so much to share with you today, so I don't want to get ahead of myself, but uh, we're, we're, we're thrilled to have everyone here. And you'll soon understand why we have such a loyal and massive following. So uh, space is, uh, is, is really filling up in 2022, especially out of Canada. Uh, you know, the pent up demand is a real thing. Uh, so keep that in mind as we uh, navigate uh, through our presentation today. And I'll introduce my team in just a moment. But uh, New Luxury is our brand, our brand direction. And to help you better understand uh, what we discovered during this pause, uh, we're gonna cover a number of topics today, including uh, cutting edge design, 
luxury accommodations, uh, decadent culinary offerings, outstanding service, and a wide variety, as I mentioned earlier, of our new uh, global destinations. So it's time to look forward, time to dream. And again, what better way to do that than with Celebrity Cruises, Luxury Simplified. So we're going to, um, uh, I'm going to introduce my team right now, uh, and they're there on the screen. Perfect. Okay. So we're going to start it off uh, here in Ontario. She is in Port Credit. A nice uh, a round of applause. We can't hear you, but uh, Sandra Pennington. Hi, everyone. Thank you for joining us. Perfect. We have uh, from downtown Toronto, Maxine Gunderman. Hello, everyone. Welcome. And sticking around uh, the Toronto area from Oak Hill, we have Brenda Yeoman. Hi, everyone. Nice to see you all. And to Montreal, Quebec, Mathieu Robert. Good afternoon. And last but certainly not least, uh, we're going to welcome Chad Kovalenko from Vancouver. Hi, everybody from the West Coast. Awesome. So these are my co-hosts today. They're going to be taking you through the first half of our presentation today. Uh, we're going to cover a lot of the shipboard experiences, uh, our beautiful ships, as I mentioned, design, accommodations. Uh, and then the second half, the latter part of our presentation, we're going to take you on that whirlwind tour of some of the new and exciting destinations. So we also have, and John mentioned this, the Q&A box available. Um, we've had a, a few events uh, this week and we've had hundreds of questions come in. So don't be shy to ask. This is the time to do it. We have a full team for both Expedia and Celebrity here to answer those questions for you. And we'll do our best to, uh, to do that. So um, the big topic that we're going to cover today, one of the ones is a healthy return to service. Uh, I mentioned the tour of the ships, the destinations, our big promotion, which will be a limited time offer specifically for you, our Expedia guests. And, uh, and then we'll wrap it up with a, uh, a prize at the end. So it's worth uh, sticking around for. So to get right into it, uh, we did want to touch on our healthy return to service. So the health and safety of our guest crew and the destinations we visit will and always has been our primary goal. So uh, way back in August of last year, we put together what we call the Blue Ribbon Panel, which consisted of um, a, a group of doctors, scientists. We actually had the ex-directors uh, of the CDC and the FDA uh, as a part of this group. And they would put together a robust plan, a robust plan of, of protocols and procedures for us to follow. We submitted that to the CDC, who we can continue to work with in making sure we are above and beyond. We want to be the cleanest, safest, most enjoyable place to vacation uh, anywhere in the world. And so this uh, panel put all this great information together. We submitted it. The CDC reviewed. They gave us some additional uh, guidance on it. Uh, we were happy to oblige. Our ships have been retrofitted with uh, enhanced ventilation systems. Our medical facilities and teams uh, have been enhanced. Our crew training, uh, all through the employees and the, and the entire corporation have been trained on these new protocols. And, and the great thing is they continue to evolve. So you're going to see a lot of updates. And again, that's why it's so important to stay close to your travel advisor uh, throughout um, um, uh, this process as we return into service, because they are changing and updating with the vaccine rolls out, uh, rollouts and the uh, testing. But everything that we've become accustomed to on land, as you can see on the screen, from uh, face coverings, uh, social distancing, uh, reduced capacity. When we do start sailing here in June, we'll be at about a 40% capacity, so less than half the ship. Uh, and we'll vamp that back up as, as the vaccines roll up and, uh, and, of course, the enhanced spacing. Another great tool we have that we actually rolled out at the beginning of last year, even before this pause, was Muster 2.0. And my captain's club, or if you've cruised before with other lines, you know about our uh, emergency drill that happens before we sail. That is no longer the case. You have the app now. You will check in at your station at your leisure within a given time frame, uh, just so you know the route from uh, there to your stateroom back and forth and alternate routes. But it's on the app. It's seamless. No more crowds getting together and interrupting uh, any of your vacation experience. So that's a great uh, little perk there for you. And it, we went a little bit further with the app as well, uh, making sure that there is no lines or any groups sort of gathering at any time on the ship, which everyone is appreciated above. So we have everything from dining and entertainment 
uh, to other activities on the ship that you'll just sort of uh, check in with your app or you'll be called when your table is ready uh, through the app. So it's really cool technology. Again, it, it complements the vacation. It's not intrusive whatsoever if you, if you were thinking that. So uh, that is just some of the areas that we are working on. And again, uh, we continue to update our, our partners. And uh, that's where I think uh, now more than ever, the importance of using a travel advisor is, is, is so great. So it's time to start our virtual tour. Uh, you booked your dream cruise with the, your Expedia Travel Advisor. You're now in the terminal, having just checked in through a touchless and seamless check-in process. And it's time to head aboard. So going back to my roots, I was once a cruise director, worked on board the ships. Uh, I'll omit the toilets and towel jokes, I promise. But you're lucky enough to have booked yourself on a beautiful celebrity apex. All right, and you went for it and you booked yourself into a suite so let's join Brenda right now in the retreat. Brenda, how is new luxury treating you? Well, hello, Alan, and all of our wonderful customers out there from Expedia Cruises. I'm sitting here in the iconic suite on board our beautiful new ship, Apex, being spoiled. And I'm going to share, well, and I'm drinking champagne, as you all know, you get welcomed on board with champagne. And when you're in the retreat in the suites, you, you get to beat everyone else on board. So it's a really good thing. Um, here's a beautiful picture of one of my favorite accommodations in the retreat, and that's the Edge Villa. And I'll show you another photo of that later on. But listen, this is your vacation. You've been pent up for a year now. You spend your well-saved money and you spoil yourself because you spend a lot of time in your accommodations. So I'm gonna take you through some of my top favorite accommodations, but really to tell you about the retreat, it's all inclusive. It includes all great amenities and features. And one of my favorites is the retreat sun deck. And this is an area where you get to relax and enjoy the sunshine all by yourself, well, with the other uh, retreat guests and uh, get champagne served to you. There's wonderful culinary delights and it's totally private. And you have a butler that will take care of you. And it's the best views on the ship at the front. Another great area is the um, retreat lounge. And this is open 24 seven. You'll have wonderful um, menus of different food at breakfast, lunch, and hors d'oeuvres in the evening. Of course, cocktail service and um, self-serve as well as full service. It's private. There's a concierge there to take care of all of your needs, whether it be shore excursions, train uh, schedules when you're in port, or just helping you with the specialty dining arrangements. But then the ultimate area when you're in the retreat is the Lumine restaurant. This is exclusive for our retreat guests and Lumine has amazing cuisine featuring specialty menu items from Danielle Baloud and he is a Michelin five-star chef. You can go in there breakfast, lunch, and dinner and it's open seating and you can go in anytime or you can make reservations and it is absolutely phenomenal. So those are exclusive venues just for our retreat guests. Plus you get all the VIP events and the special services and special amenities in your room. You truly are treated like a full on movie star, a celebrity when you're staying in the retreat. Now there's lots of different suites to choose from in the accommodations. And as I mentioned, one of my favorite uh, areas is the Edge Villa. And the Edge Villa is two stories. Now the Edge Villas you can only find on Apex or Edge. It has a plunge pool, one bedroom, two bathrooms, the bedrooms on the top, and then a great sitting area down below. So that is absolutely phenomenal. So that's the Edge Villas. And you can see lots of square foot footage, beautiful views. But there's lots of other suites to choose from as well. So make sure you ask your travel advisor to um, give you, um, show you some of the different suite accommodations. But if you're not in a suite, some of the other are the Edge series. We have the Infinite Verandas, and this is in concierge class and aqua class staterooms. It gives you more space. You can open up your veranda doors and have more space 
to your stateroom. So that is really neat. And you can see the bathrooms are larger by 10% and the rooms are larger as well. Wonderful amenities and decor by Kelly Hoppin. So those are infinite verandas. And I think one of you had a question about solo travelers. Well, guess what? On our apex and edge, we do have single staterooms with the infinite veranda. So we'd welcome you uh, to come join us on those ships anywhere around the world. And we also have another class of stateroom, which is called concierge class. And this is a step up from a standard veranda where it gives you a little bit more taste of the sweet life minus the big butler and all of the square footage, but certainly a beautiful room with some special signature amenities. But ultimately, I wanna stay in aqua class. Why? Because phenomenal rooms, you have access, your restaurant is blue. It's an ex exclusive, clean cuisine, gourmet, amazing menus, and complimentary access to the Persian gardens, which is amazing. And the, uh, where the Aqua Class staterooms are located is in a phenomenal area right by our um, spa area. And I think we have a little um, picture here of some of the facilities, um, like the Blue Restaurant and then the Persian Gardens as well. Um, this is a picture of the Millennium Series um, a stateroom that you would have with Aqua Class as well. And as you can see, we've um, totally revolutionize the summit and the millennium right now. Our other two ships are on their way to be revolutionized, but you can see how beautiful these ships look and they look like mini edges. And then of course we go to the actual um, pictures that I was speaking about with uh, Blue, the beautiful restaurant. This is one of my favorite spaces just because it looks so beautiful. On edge class vessels, you can dine al fresco or indoors, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And of course you have different dining times to choose from or any time. And then to finish it all off, of course, the beautiful spa facilities on board, Persian gardens. It's simply amazing and lots of great treatment rooms. I particularly love those thermal chairs. And we have a real spa lover on our team. She loves the spa and I'm gonna let Sandra take you through a few um, wonderful spaces on board our ship. Sandra, are you there? I'm there, hi, yeah, I've moved to the spa here um, where I like to clear my mind and reinvigorate my spirit, which we can definitely do in the spas on Celebrity Cruises. And I'd like to take you through a tour of the spa um, you're going to see the edge here, but we have beautiful spas fleet wide, but specifically on the edge, this is a 13,000 square foot spa, and it's the ultimate gateway for relaxation uh, for the mind and body. And all of our ships offer a wide variety of, and assortment of rejuvenating treatments, but specifically on edge, this is the sea thermal suite, and it's uh, eight unique experiences, uh, complimentary for aqua class, um, but other guests have the option to indulge. Now, we're going to move to the solarium, which is also one of my favorite spots on board. Um, it is a curved pool and hot tub lounge reserved for adults only. It's enclosed in glass, so no matter the weather, you're going to enjoy the pool and hot tub. And it has, again, this area is available fleet-wide, and it has a beautiful spa cafe that I utilize. Moving now to the fitness center. So if you would like to work out on your vacation, we have the fitness center has floor-to-ceiling windows. It's got the latest in the uh, our gym equipment, weight machines, cardio equipment, etc. Now I'm not done because now I want to show you what we've introduced on Edge Class, which is a phenomenal area called the Grand Plaza in the heart of the ship. It's phenomenal, and I'm going to take you on a tour. It's spanning three decks. It's the ship's epicenter, and it's surrounded by all sides by restaurants and bars and more and cafes. And it's reminiscent of the iconic Italian piazzas that influence its designs. It's just beautiful and chic. And it's a great rendezvous point due to its midship location uh, and also one of the most liveliest spaces on board. And in the AM, I know I like to go there and enjoy uh, a latte or my husband an herbal tea or a cappuccino, my kids hot chocolate. Um, and it's really one of my favorite spaces on board at Cafe Albaccio. You really do have to go there and try some of the treats that are, are available, complimentary as well. 
And then right in the middle is the focus uh, of the of the Grand Plaza, of course, is the Martini Bar, which is phenomenal. And I know Maxine's going to tell you a little bit more about that Martini Bar coming up. Uh, of course, fleet-wide, we have amazing lounges on Solstice and Millennium Class as well. So I just want to show you in this quick video uh, what lounges, what the lounge spaces uh, look like on our ships. They're, they're chic. They're stunning. You can enjoy cocktails and martinis um, and uh, nightly choreographed, uh, sorry, Sometimes there's entertainment in there all throughout the day, and it changes from day to evening as well uh, with what's available in there. But uh, the live music is phenomenal, and one of my favorite parts as well. And the first video here was featuring the Rendezvous Lounge. Uh, and then coming up, we have the Ensemble Lounge here, which is a great place for a quick stop for drinks before dinner or a nightcap. And we do wine appreciations as well in there. So just a great space overall. And you can see we do have uh, musicians in there as well. And then lastly, a quick tour of Eden, which is our new lounge on Edge Class, uh, which again is on Edge, but debuting soon on Apex. And look at this, spanning three decks high, all windows. And Chad is going to touch on the entertainment a little later. I think it's going to be Alan. Um, lastly, check out this picture. This is on Solstice Class, because fleet-wide we have amazing atriums. Um, but this is specifically on our Solstice Class ships. That is a live tree that is 20 foot high, suspended in the air. And on each of our Solstice Class ships, they are unique as well. And uh, what a stunning piece of art to look at. It's a huge focal point. So check that out here, uh, sailing on one of our Solstice Class ships. All right, I think now we're going to be moving. If we can go to the next stuff. Uh, oh, we're going to move to Matthew. And we're going to get a little bit of fresh air. So Matthew, where are you? That's right, Sandra. I'm currently on the top deck of Celebrity Apex. Let me bring you on a quick tour. We're currently on the pool deck around with our beautiful cabanas that can be rented for the entire cruise or simply for a single day. Now let's see the longest pool in the world at sea. That's right. It's a 25 meters long pool right in the center of Celebrity Edge and Celebrity Apex with plenty of space in the pool, but also outside with all the lounge chairs that we have. It is also a great spot for hanging around during the day, but also in the evening as we have a beautiful bar right next to this beautiful piece of art, as well as beautiful hot tubs on each side of the pool. So this is just a great place to hang out and for parties as well during your cruise. Now let's see this unique magic carpet only available on Celebrity Edge and Celebrity Apex. This is a unique venue located over the ocean. And that's right, it is literally over the ocean. And it, this is a perfect for group meetings, for group space, but also just to hang there with with a cocktail uh, in, in this lounge that can be also converted into specialty dining, which my colleague Maxine will tell us more about later. But just again, a unique uh, feature that we have only on Celebrity Edge and Celebrity Apex. Now let's move to the aft part of those ships that is called the rooftop garden. That is real garden with real trees, real flowers, and just a perfect lounge to hang out as well. Uh, we also have musicians, a huge TV screen, or we'll be showcasing and displaying movies, concerts, and different types of shows the, during your entire cruise. So again, a perfect place for parties, for dancing uh, in the evenings on the rooftop garden on Celebrity Edge and Celebrity Apex. But our, on our other ships, on the Solstice Class Series ships, we will have the alcoves, which are the little cabanas around the long club. And this is real grass on top of those ships. So just a unique uh, venue as well for taking, uh, being, having activities on top on real grass. So let's do a quick recap of those activities as we're currently on the magic carpet and then on the beautiful rooftop garden. And now let's move to the longest pool in the world at sea Celebrity Edge and Celebrity Apex. And finally, the beautiful pool deck uh, on Celebrity Edge and Apex again. But now all this walking around the ship got me a little bit hungry. Maxine, where are you now? That's right. After having a little bit of a ship tour, especially on the first day of my cruise, I start to get hungry and I get excited to dine. So right now, I am in the main dining room on board one of our Solstice series ships. And what you're going to know about Celebrity Cruises is no matter what your culinary tastes are, 
you, there is something for everyone. From the main dining room that does breakfast, lunch, and dinner, where the menu changes every single evening. This one here shows, showcases a two-story high wine tower that hosts over 1,600 bottles of wine. But then on the Millennium Series, as you see here, we have a completely different venue, beautiful wall of windows uh, with the ocean views. As Brenda mentioned, if you're dining in blue, or if you're sailing in aqua class, you dine at blue, which is an exclusive restaurant for breakfast and dinner. And our retreat guests dine at Lumine, a private dining venue with an exclusive menu and a signature menu curated by Chef Danielle Bouloud, who is a multiple Michelin star chef who is our global culinary ambassador as well. Now, if you want more variety, even so, you're finding yourself at the Ocean View Cafe, a buffet at the top deck of the ship, floor-to-ceiling windows, and fabulous variety of food. So even while temporarily we might do full service here in the buffet, it still will be accessible for all of our guests. Now, if that wasn't enough, we have specialty dining options as well. And what's unique is that every ship has a different combination of restaurants to choose from. Here is the Lawn Club Grill, an outdoor venue, the celebrity chef grilling table side and custom-made pizzas as well. Or is it Le Petit Chef, which is a 4K projection presentation where a tiny cartoon chef is preparing your food in an animation form right in front of your eyes, and then those four courses are presented to you. Here we have Tuscan Grill, a rustic Italian steakhouse that has homemade, fresh, everyday pasta dishes and other unique regional inspirations with a fabulous wine pairing, especially with our beverage package included. And here we have rich, decadent French cuisine with the white tablecloth service found at Murano with tableside flambe and a really phenomenal experience. Or something lighter, you'll find yourself at Sushi on Five or Raw on Five for a unique a la carte menu of Japanese specials and sushi dishes as well. Other outdoor venues, perfect for lunch, would be the porch. And at the porch, you'll find seafood and panini grills, soups and salads, wonderful experience on the lawn club of two of our Solstice series ships. So all of that decadent food and different styles for everyone, it's cocktail time. And it's something that we do very well. We have the largest wine list at sea and a wide variety of different venues. Here you're seeing the infamous Martini Bar, full of live action where our bartenders are famous for their bar flair. Take a look at him pouring all of those martinis all at once, ice topped on Millennium and Solstice series. Here is Craft Social with a unique menu of craft beers, pub fare, digital TV screens, live music. It is a wonderful experience, a beautiful venue for a little bit of a, a different feel. If you want to be in the middle of the action, you'll find Passport Bar just off the main atrium. It's also a great place for live music and wonderful before or after dinner as you're waiting for the theater show to begin. At World Class Bar, we take cocktails very seriously. You're seeing a molecular bartender here that is focused on the art of fusion, so using some phenomenal ingredients. It's all about showcasing those, those cocktails. Ensemble Lounge and Rendezvous Lounge, famous for live music of all sorts of different varieties. There's jazz trios and string quartets, and the piano in the martini bar, as seen here on Celebrity Edge, is quite the masterpiece as well. So no matter what your flavors are, there is something for everyone on board a celebrity cruise when it comes to the culinary experience and food and wine. So with that, I want to take it back to our cruise director to talk about entertainment. And Alan, you're muted still. We want to make sure we can hear everything you have to say. Is that any better? That's perfect. Great. So I, uh, I apologize for the opening. Apparently I was too loud 
and maybe a little too enthusiastic, but I'm excited. So hopefully you can hear me a little bit better now. So uh, as your cruise director for tonight's virtual uh, for today's virtual show, it's it's my responsibility to share the entertainment news, and there's definitely lots to tell. So Celebrity Cruises has once again broken the mold in the cruise industry by being a luxury cruise line that is far from sleepy and boring. With amazing entertainment options, you're going to want to set your wake-up call not for 9 a.m., but for 9 p.m. So you can get out there and catch all of the great entertainment and activities. So we're going to show a video here in just a moment, but uh, get ready for some amazing shows at sea. Celebrity offers captivating main stage productions that will leave you topping long after the roar of the applause and final bows. And it happens in our newly designed theaters you'll see here on the screen that rival some of the most innovative stages anywhere in the world. These venues and their state of the art. Um, sorry, I broke up there. Can you still hear me? Okay, so state-of-the-art design allow us to transport our guests into the journey and experience each performance firsthand. We know you'll want to see each of our shows, all of these amazing shows during your vacation, and the theater will definitely be a spot you visit more than once. So you can experience shows like Crystallize, an inspiring high-flying visual you see here on the screen, uh, Escape with multi-talented casts sourced from around the world. Uh, we do ask that you not try these in your living room and home later. This is the Tree of Life, a series of live events that are universal and meaningful, uh, something we can all relate to now more than ever. Another great show that has received numerous awards is Illyria, an adult-only fashion-forward fairy tale with a sultry late-night vibe. And talk about diverse, we offer a full rock concert experience to a refined date night at the ballet. And not just any ballet, we offer the American Ballet Theater. So at Celebrity Cruises, there is truly something for everyone. And on Celebrity Edge series ships, uh, they're designed to change the way you experience the world. And as you can see now on the screen, this is Eden, our incredible three-story venue. We invite you to indulge all of your senses in a transformative atmosphere that changes from chillful mornings, playful afternoons, into sinful evenings. With over 12,000 square feet of event space, Eden is a great location for DJs, uh, we've got a very special New Year's Eve party, every cruise, international themed events, even magical wedding celebrations, anything you can dream of. This is uh, one of the best venues at sea. Another dynamic venue you'll discover on our Edge Series ships is the club. It's a progressive multi-purpose space that changes character from morning to, well, early the next morning. Uh, a during the really day, exciting the club thing. Is a Space. Hone your activity, your creativity during an art hour, our, our rec room series, uh, uh, archery, uh, retro gaming, or if you're over 45 years old, just regular gaming, I guess, and interactive game shows in the evening. It transforms into uh, talk shows and game shows, live DJs, theme parties. It's, it's just one of the hot spots on the ship, whether you're stopping by during the day just to hang out for a bit or come back in the evening when it changes into a place of wild discovery. There's nightlife that's super engaging. And one of the great things about the entertainment on the ship, a lot of it are pop-up performances, totally unexpected, and uh, it's truly amazing. And I can't say enough, uh, Maxine touched on it, but the, the venues are, are so great. The entertainment complements each of the venues and the design of the ship. But the live music we have at Celebrity Cruises is second to none. It's one of the biggest things I miss that I've heard talking to partners and our, our Captain's Club members about how amazing our musicians are. So... Um, I'd love to go on and on about that, but uh, it's now time to head into the second part of our presentation, and thank you uh, for sticking with us so far. We certainly hope you're enjoying it, but we're going to take you on a whirlwind tour right now of some of the uh, destinations we visit. We are a destination brand. We visit over 300 destinations worldwide, and we have more overnights. Think about that. We have more overnights than any other brand out there. So we're going to start right now the tour with Matt here, who is currently in Santorini. That's right, Alan. I'm currently on the old continent of Europe. And let me show you the unique itineraries that we have on Celebrity Edge, including the beautiful port of call of Santorini. So here we have Celebrity Edge for a 12-night sailing in October of 2022, doing Italy, Turkey, and Greek house. And we've been able to showcase the unique pricing advantage with, with, that we have with Expedia Cruises. But as you can see, there's a, a very uh, important difference uh, between the prevailing rates and the group rates available to the exclusive staterooms uh, available only with Expedia Cruises. 
So as you can see with the itinerary, it's just uh, amazing going all through the Greek Isles and also having a stop in Istanbul. This is the first time for a while that celebrity has been able to uh, have a port of call in Istanbul and we're spending the entire night in Istanbul. So that is just amazing. And let's see the beautiful celebrity edge in front of the iconic island of Santorini. That is definitely a must see destination in Europe. Now, let's see another very unique and off the beat and bat itinerary. This is the Greenland and Iceland itinerary that we have on Celebrity Summit Revolutionized for 12 nights in August of 2022. We actually have two of those itineraries on each, uh, on each way, basically. This one is leaving out of Reykjavik, the capital of Iceland, going to northern Iceland, southern Greenland, and also going through the Maritimes, including Newfoundland, Nova Scotia, and ending in Boston. Again, the price advantage is just incredible, and the itinerary is so unique because we only have two of those uh, in 2022. Now, let's see this amazing picture of Prince Christian Sound. This is one of the fjords that you'll be able to visit and cruise through during the itinerary on board Celebrity Summit. Now, let's move to Northern Europe, as we have the unique Scandinavia-Russia itineraries on board the newest Celebrity Apex. For 12 nights, this is again in August of 2022, leaving round trip out of Amsterdam and going through all of the unique countries of Northern Europe, including Germany, the Denmark, Sweden, Finland, Estonia, and of course, Russia. Again, you see the incredible pricing with Expedia exclusive patrons. Always included is the drinks, tips, and Wi-Fi included in all of those prices. And let's see one of the great features in Russia. This is Peterhof Palace. This is a must-see uh, attraction for sure. Just outside of St. Petersburg, a palace and fountains and gardens are just amazing. Uh, definitely a must-do uh, activity right there. Now let's go to the Mediterranean, where we have, again, very unique itineraries here. We actually have only three of those on each season. This is in September of 2022, again on Celebrity Apex, a newest ship for 12 nights. Round trip out of Rome. And this itinerary goes to the Holy Land, including two ports of call in Israel and also a beautiful port of call in Cyprus, including, of course, some destinations in Greece. So these itineraries are just unique, incredibly beautiful. The price advantage is there as well. And let's see one of the pictures that we got for the old city of Jerusalem that can be visited out of the two ports of call in Israel, Ashdod and Haifa. So definitely a very cultural uh, destination to visit in 2022. And now last but not least, we also have an incredible sailing in Spain and France on board the newly revolutionized Celebrity Silhouette for nine nights in September of 2022. This cruise will be round trip out of Southampton in the UK, including beautiful ports of call in northern Spain, which is quite rare in general. And we have also a port of call in Vigo right next to Santiago de Compostela. It is just amazing. But the great and unique feature that we have is that we have an overnight in La Rochelle in France. And the great feature with La Rochelle is that it's just right next to the region of Bordeaux. So if you're looking for any wine tastings and discovering the vineyards of uh, Bordeaux, this is the perfect itinerary for you, again, on Celebrity Silhouette. But now it's getting quite warm in Europe. So let's move over to Alaska. Thanks very much, Matthew. You've got me excited about Europe, uh, but Alaska 2022 is definitely something that we want to get excited about. Uh, we have confirmation that we have three of our new luxury ships based on the West Coast to do Alaska. And so we've got the beautiful Celebrity Eclipse and the newly revolutionized Celebrity Millennium, both uh, home ported out of Vancouver. And then we've got the beautiful and award-winning Celebrity Solstice out of Seattle. Um, we've got some amazing itineraries to take a look at. I truly feel uh, that Celebrity Cruises owns the Alaska market. Um, one of my favorite family vacations that I think we've done for the last six years consecutive has been this itinerary here. You depart out of Vancouver, you actually go on the inside of Vancouver Island to experience the inside passage. And if that is not meaningful for you, folks, one of the things I just want to make mention of is our ships going up the inside passage. 
that is the area where you have the highest content of all of the marine life and the chance to see killer whales and breaching whales, uh, the broken group of islands. It's such an incredible uh, part of the coastline to really experience. Obviously, we've got some other great highlights on this itinerary, including Sitka, Alaska, a, a very unique and adventurous destination, Hubbard Glacier, Juneau. It's just, it's beautiful. So want you to know that seven-day round-trip opportunity is there for Vancouver for you. We also have some other great itineraries to be taking a look at and special pricing uh, with our partners from Expedia Cruises. This is a wonderful 11-night long Alaska to take a look at. And aside from the fact that you really get a very in-depth look at Alaska, including Endicott Arm and Skagway, and certainly the Cadillac of uh, glaciers with Hubbard Glacier, the pricing here that Expedia holds as our partner, starting at less than $2,500 for an 11-night long Alaska, it's honestly just amazing. So that's uh, another one to keep an eye on. That one's September 11th of 22. We do have a couple of more to take a look at that I think are worth mentioning here for you. And getting up into beautiful Endicott Arm, which if you haven't seen this part of the world, it is truly stunning. And we have the opportunity to fly up to Alaska and do what we call an open jaw itinerary starting in Seward, heading all of the best highlights as you meander down and finally end off with that beautiful inside passage and finishing off in uh, Vancouver. And you can see Expedia pricing from $1,673 uh, to give you all of the very best that Alaska has to offer there on the beautiful revolutionized millennium. And there's that great shot and gives you an idea of how up close we can actually get to that beautiful Hubbard Glacier experience while cruising Alaska. And finally, what I would strongly recommend is if you have not experienced Alaska yet, an Alaska cruise tour will allow you to experience the very best of cruising Alaska with us and then tying on a amazing land-based experience with one of our cruise tour packages, which will allow you to get off the ship and experience the very best of Alaska on shore. And one of my favorite destinations in the world that we haven't been in for a very long time is the Mexican Riviera. We're extremely excited to be back in this beautiful part of the world. We're offering two new itineraries to take a look at. We have an eight night Mexican Riviera and a seven night Mexican Riviera. Some highlights to keep in mind here. Um, you're looking at having an overnight in Cabo San Lucas. Uh, you're looking at hitting um, Cabo, Mazatlan, uh, Puerto Vallarta, and the price, unbelievable lead-ins from just over $1,500 for a week of, of new luxury exploring the best of Mexico on the Mexican Riviera. And I think on that note uh, of some sunshine and beaches, uh, Sandra, where are you right now? I, I think you've got a hat on, so obviously it's sunny where you are. That's right. It's, I move quick. I'm now in the Virgin Islands. Uh, which is real dear to my heart because it's where I got married in 2005. But before I take everyone on a tour of the Caribbean, Bermuda, and Panama Canal, I know we have some Canadians and Americans on this webinar, so I want to mention that you can book in either Canadian or U.S. funds, so that is an option for everyone. Now, if you're like me, right now you are craving an island-hopping journey to soak up some sun and unwind in the Caribbean, Bermuda, or Panama Canal, um, and we offer – anywhere from a four to 12 night cruises. We actually have eight different ships with the addition of Apex in the Caribbean. So you imagine we have a great variety of ports that we call on in the Caribbean. And, and on a 10 night or longer, often they have an overnight. So look for those hidden gems. Um, we also have some short getaways, four and five nights as well. But I think 
a lot of us who are trying to get away are looking for a seven night or longer. So I'm going to focus on those. But if you are interested in a shorter, just reach out to your travel consultant at Expedia. I'm going to start with our newest ship, Celebrity Apex here, um, doing a seven night Eastern Caribbean, GN through April of 2022. This ship is uh, out of Fort Lauderdale at Terminal 25, which is our newest cheap terminal. And having been in this industry for a long time, this is the sh- peer winning the fastest peer check-in. So from the time you get out of your car or your bus, you are in your room within 20 to 25 minutes. Um, And Apex, when she's not in Europe, is in the Caribbean doing phenomenal itineraries like this example, Eastern Caribbean doing Fort Lauderdale, St. Thomas, which is where I am now, uh, St. Kitts in Puerto Rico. And as you can see, Expedia has some amazing exclusive rates. And I highlighted the January 15th sailing now because in the winter, I, I cannot wait to get away, having had to stay home this entire winter for next year in 2022. Let's move to the next slide here. And we have the Millennium, which we're putting back in the Caribbean. Um, now, I know Chad mentioned that we're doing Mexican Riviera. Well, when she wraps up the Mexican R- Riviera mini season, she's going to do a trans canal sailing and work her way towards San Juan, Puerto Rico. So we are going back into San Juan January through April of 2023, doing seven nights Southern Caribbean. Each of the itineraries are slightly different, but they're amazing exotic itineraries. They truly are my favorite. Checking out this one, San Juan, Puerto Rico, British Virgin Islands, St. Martin, Martinique, Barbados, and Granada. And again, amazing rates with Expedia there that you can see uh, on the board where I highlighted January 14th. So check those out when we're back in Puerto Rico in 2023. Moving to the next screen here, we have uh, the Celebrity Equinox. Now, the Equinox is going to be in the Caribbean year-round. She's our only ship in the Caribbean year-round, so you can imagine she has a lot of great itineraries. I think there's just a delay on the slide, but it'll be up here in a moment. We're going to be looking. We, we see the nine-night Aruba, Curacao, and Grand Cayman cruise. And again, such a variety on the Equinox because she is there all year round in the Caribbean. She's also out of Fort Lauderdale. And this particular itinerary that I've highlighted is March 25th. Uh, and it, it's visiting Curacao, Aruba, Grand Cayman, and Nassau, Bahamas. We're going to move now to the next screen here just to show you a slightly longer sailing. I believe we're going to be featuring a 10 night on the Celebrity Edge. Now, Edge, she's going to be doing 10 and 11 night exotic itineraries. Again, she's out of Fort Lauderdale, but beautiful itineraries, whereas the Apex are doing seven night Eastern and Western. So if you're looking for something longer, take a look at Edge. I featured uh, November 11th here. She's going to visit St. Martin, Antigua, St. Lucia, Barbados, St. Kitts. And keep in mind, Caribbean has phenomenal beaches, but it, it you know, if you're all about uh, ruins and history, you can check those types of things out. Uh, you know, there's great snorkeling and water activities, shopping. If you're a foodie, Caribbean offers a great variety of culinary. Um, and so there is a lot to do there as well, other than just sitting on a beach. I keep quite busy. Uh, we're going to go next to the next screen and feature the Constellation. What's unique about the Constellation is she doing 10 and 11 night Caribbean cruises that are out of Tampa. And Tampa is a phenomenal pre or post uh, cruise. There's easily accessible flights both from Canada and the States. Um, and on top of that, there's it's close enough to, to Orlando and uh, uh, the terminal there has had a huge, I think it's like a $10 million makeover. So a great port to start and end from. And the, the itineraries are exotic. This particular one going to Grand Cayman, Colombia, uh, Cologne, Panama, Costa Rica, and Cozumel. Um, and so check out the other ones because they're all unique as well. Featured here is the January 24th sailing in 2022. Now we're going to move to Bermuda, which I think is a hidden gem. If you've never been to Bermuda, the pink sand beaches, the shopping, the um, the nightlife, the culinary, uh, the exploration of the different cities there. Uh, there's so much to do. And we are there in two months in the summer uh, with uh, the Celebrity Revolutionized Summit. And uh, we start in and out of Cape Liberty, New Jersey. So you can fly into either Newark or any of the New York airports. Do a pre or post stay and explore. And then once you get on the ship, you will have three sea days to enjoy the ship, but you also have two full overnight, almost three full days in Bermuda to go and really, truly explore this beautiful destination. I've probably been there about 20 times and I've taken my husband and my kids and we do something different each time. One of our favorite experiences is sailing past the Statue of Liberty when departing Cape Liberty. It's just gorgeous. And as you can see, again, Expedia has phenomenal rates exclusive to them. 
Next, we're going to move to the Panama Canal. This is the last destination I want to mention um, because we do have select sailings throughout the Panama Canal. I want to highlight the Millennium, which is before she goes to San Juan, Puerto Rico, she does this gorgeous holiday sailing on December 19, 2022, which is a Panama Canal sailing with exclusive rates here. Um, she's going to start in Fort Lauderdale, go to uh, Sorry, she's going to start in Los Angeles, go to Cabo San Lucas, Puerto Vallarta, Puerto Tetzel, Punta Arenas, Chile, Cologne, Panama. The Panama Canal Day is a full day of going through the locks. We bring on the best of the best to tell you all about the locks. The past, present, and future is informative. It's fun. Bring the sunscreen. We'll have drink carts out there serving you drinks because it's hot as well, but it's a phenomenal day. And then we move to Cartagena, back to Fort Lauderdale. And then the Edge is also doing some trans-canal sailing round trip Fort Lauderdale at the end of uh, 2022 as well, if you're interested in those. All right, I think we're going to keep it hot now, um, and we're going to move somewhere more exotic. Where are you, Maxine? Yes, it might have been a long flight, but I am here in Japan, and I want to tour you around three uniquely exotic destinations. So for your winter getaway between November and April, instead of the Caribbean, I want to show you Asia on Celebrity Solstice, Australia and New Zealand on Celebrity Eclipse, and South America on the beautiful Celebrity Infinity. So let's start in the heart of Asia. And we have a very famous Vietnam cruise. And after not traveling for as long as we have, I want you to imagine being here. This is Da Nang, Vietnam, and it really is off the beaten path to see something so spectacular. And the best way to travel Asia is by cruise because we can go to so many different countries with the comfort of unpacking just the one. So this particular cruise either starts in Hong Kong or in Singapore in either direction. So this one that I've chosen for you today starts in Hong Kong in just one Sea Day will get you to the port of Hanoi. You are looking at Ha Long Bay. So imagine taking a boat cruise to this exotic area. There are three Vietnam ports on this itinerary. You see the second one is Da Nang. The third is Ho Chi Minh City before an overnight in Bangkok and an overnight in Singapore as well. This is a 14-night cruise in 2022, and it's a 12-night cruise in 2023. So you have two seasons to book through. The pricing you're seeing here are indeed in Canadian dollars. These are exclusive Expedia rates, and you can book in either Canadian dollars or U.S. dollars, of course, for our Expedia offices in the U.S. All of the Expedia rates are refundable deposits as well and always include the drinks, tips, and Wi-Fi. So significant savings, as you can see here. When you're finished this cruise, you will end in Singapore. And Singapore is a destination in and of itself. You're going to see it is such a dynamic city with that famous Marine Sands Bay Hotel. Imagine having a cocktail on the infinity pool at the top of that with the beautiful vistas. And the airport is known can be the world's best airport. That is an airport right there in, in Singapore. Absolutely sensational experience in and out of there. The other way to experience Asia is through Japan. And we have more Japan sailings than ever before. What you're looking at now is in Kyoto, a famous castle, and a wonderful opportunity for the cherry blossom season, which is right now. So March, April, perfect season to go. That's why I've chosen a couple of Japan cruises to show you, the first of which is the Best of Japan, which fully circumnavigates. Uh, a lot of people don't realize that Japan is actually five major islands, but an entire archipelago that goes all the way south. So, so much diversity here. You're seeing temples and shrines, and of course, Mount Fuji can be seen from Tokyo, as well as the port in Mount Fuji. So, great deals here, whether again, April of 22 is next year, but again, you have 2023 available to you as well. So, no matter where you are in your planning stages, book now, because this one in particular has very limited inventory, and you can see it's nearly selling out. The pricing's amazing. Again, these examples are in Canadian dollars, which even our American friends would love to pay in Canadian. It makes it even less, uh, but great opportunities. You can book in either currency on all of these sailings. 
Another unique itinerary is southern Japan, including these very exotic southern islands. So looking at Okinawa, Ishigaki, and even the volcanic island of Jeju Island in South Korea is part of this itinerary. So very exotic and very dynamic to go from the big city of Tokyo all the way down to the south. So this one in particular is also 14 nights because the 2022 season features 14 nights. The 2023 season are fabulous 12-night sailings. So you have an overnight in Tokyo as well as another overnight through the cruise as well. So two different ports with overnights that you're going to see here. So this particular sailing is March, which is wonderful for the cherry blossom season as well. So look at that dynamic Tokyo, which is the home port for this round-trip cruise, and then heading to the exotics. Now, let's keep going, and we want to show you Australia and New Zealand. And you're going to either home port in Sydney, start or end your cruise in Sydney, Australia, sailing by the famous Sydney Opera House, sailing under that iconic bridge. You can even climb over that bridge as a shore excursion. One of the most popular itineraries, very rare, only happens a couple times per season, is going up to the Great Barrier Reef. So from Sydney, round trip, this one is February 28th of 2023. Wanted to give you an example of that. And there's great adventure, exotic beaches on the north end, and a really unique place called Eden that is quite the place, a, a real paradise on earth. So Australia is certainly a place where you want to cruise because it is so large. You have that comfortability of unpacking once and waking up in a different destination every day. On the top end of the island uh, of Australia, you're going to see this wonderful Daintree rainforest, dense, uh, robust, so phenomenal. So even if it's not for the snorkeling and scuba diving, there is a lot to see up there. There is another opportunity, of course, with New Zealand. Two different ways to do it. This one is a round trip Sydney, but we also have the one way from Auckland to Sydney or Sydney to Auckland. Sometimes we stop in Hobart, Tasmania. Sometimes we stop in Melbourne. So there are many different vari varieties in this itinerary. But this one in particular is 12 nights, October of 2022, where you're going all the way from the south end of the island of New Zealand through the sounds in the New Zealand fjords, up the eastern coast of wine country, for those wine lovers of you, and to the exotic beaches on the top end. So again, great value with the Expedia exclusive staterooms, wonderful, it's refundable pricing. These examples are in Canadian dollars, but with Expedia cruises, uh, of course, if you are in the States, you have the ability to book in U.S. dollars as well. Always included, drinks, Wi-Fi, and tips. And this is what you have to look forward to. The scenic cruising through the New Zealand fjords with the waterfalls just going straight into the water, absolutely sensational. If you want to get even more exotic, imagine going to the South Pacific. And you're going to find two unique itineraries. One from Auckland, New Zealand, round trip, 13 nights, going to Fiji, going to Samoa, an American Samoa. And then on the other side, you could also go out of Sydney. And then you're going to Vanuatu and New Caledonia and the Loyalty Islands. So two very unique, culturally rich, exotic areas of all of those beautiful beaches that we're just dreaming about going to. If you have more time and you want to go to French Polynesia to visit Bora Bora and Tahiti, you would find yourself on our 18-night sailing from Sydney to Honolulu in the springtime or Honolulu to Sydney in the fall time. This is, of course, the Celebrity Ecl Eclipse, which tr transits between this region to Alaska for the summer season. So 18 nights, phenomenal value. You're going to find Expedia does have exclusive rates here. And so for an 18 nights with drinks, tips, and Wi-Fi included, huge savings both in U.S. dollars and Canadian dollars. The last option for your winter getaway is all the way down to South America, where we start on the Celebrity Infinity. The transatlantic takes you from Lisbon, Portugal, with five stops and ends in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. So that's quite a unique opportunity to uh, go from old world Portugal to the new Portuguese settlement and you're going to find a few different itineraries here. Most common and popular is all the way around the Horn to see Patagonia of Chile and Argentina, 
rugged adventure, beautiful sights and experiences from the hot springs to the wine regions of Chile and Argentina. So that transits between Chile and Argentina with the bragging rights of going around Cape Horn where the Pacific and Atlantic Oceans meet. So again, great value. I've chosen February 27, 2022. This is a 12-night sailing. Absolutely phenomenal. Also very popular are our Antarctica cruises. In fact, we have added another one. So there are three dates to choose from every winter season. Summer for them, winter for us. So Round Trip Buenos Aires takes you all the way down for two days in Antarctica. Scenic cruising through the channels and the straits and Elephant Island. And it's a stop in Port Stanley, famous for seeing those penguins. Lots to do and see in between with the beaches of Montevideo and Uruguay and everything else, Ushuaia. Great value again. You're seeing the pricing in Canadian dollars. That's all in with the taxes, the drinks, tips, and Wi-Fi as well. So that's a 14-night sailing to Antarctica. So with that, there's only one more exotic destination to uncover, and I think Brenda is there. Brenda, where are you? Well, hello there, everybody. I am in the Galapagos Islands, one of my favorite the whole world. And you need to spoil yourself. Now is the time to go. Don't wait until tomorrow. You need to go to Galapagos now. So I'm wearing a Galapagos hat here. You need to stay out of the sun. You're on the equator, 602 the Pacific Ocean, and that's where you're going to find the Galapagos Islands. So um, this is your truly all-inclusive vacation in the Galapagos Islands. Everything's included. So just like what they're always included now, with your Galapagos adventure, it includes your flights to the Galapagos from Quito, beverages, gratuities, your entrance fee, your tourist card, your snorkeling equipment, your wetsuit. You don't need to worry about a thing. And we even have special promotions to get you to the Galapagos Islands. But this is one of those places that is for everyone. And I was fortunate enough to take my kids with me when they turned 13 to the Galapagos. So you can think about it as a family getaway. And there are different packages to choose from when you go to the Galapagos Islands because you don't just do the cruise. It's like an African safari, except your um you're getting you're on the water and you're in and out of ports like twice a day so it's a very very busy uh cruise experience you're doing everything from snorkeling to kayaking coastal explorations you're on the beach swimming snorkeling with sea lions and you're doing lots of hikes so there's something for beginners intermediate and advanced so it truly is an amazing adventure something that you will stick with you for years. And as a matter of fact, I can hardly wait to go back again. But this is where you're going to see a lot of interesting wildlife from the marine iguanas to the sea lions to the tortoises, and you're gonna to get to interact with them. It's not how many uh, you're going to see, like there are more animals than humans there. And uh, I, you know, this is just a short video of my photography, snorkeling with a sea lion and they come and check you out and it certainly is a, an amazing experience um, you know getting up close and personal with these animals so take lots of um, disk space for your cameras you're going to need to do it we have three of the best ships in the Galapagos we have been doing this now uh, for over 16 years you can go on the exploration 16 guests the expedition 48 or why not spoil yourself and go luxury in our all luxury suite Flora 100 passengers. You really need to spoil yourself. And um, I think we have a short little video just to show you a little glimpse into your experience in the Galapagos um, Islands. And just, uh, you know, the scenery, there's a beautiful flora. It certainly is, um, it's one of those vacations where you don't need to worry about a thing. We take care of everything from the shore excursions, the pre and post and keto, all the meals, everything is done celebrity style, which you know is five star all the way and done in new luxury. 
all the meals on board, we source the, the cuisine locally. Um, we're helping with sustainability in the Galapagos Islands. We're helping with the, the farming of the seafood farming cooperatives. We're helping them grow unique um, just for us, like the Galapagos tomatoes. So we're doing lots of wonderful things uh, in the Galapagos Islands. And one of the important things is we do have a lab on board giving real scientific information to scientists around the world to track, um, you know, how temperature is affecting the ocean and all of the wildlife. So some of the accommodations board are just simply outstanding from the penthouse suite to the sky suites on board Flora. Remember she is all sweet. So you are going to have the ultimate retreat. The beautiful decor on board is um, taking the outside in and um, it's very much a Galapagos feel on board the ship. And then we have the expedition suites which is on board the expedition. So this is where we have the 48 guests and very nice accommodations as well. And then on the uh, exploration, of course, we have, um, it's smaller, so it's more adventure type. What itineraries to choose from? We have inner, outer, northern, southern. On every itinerary, you're gonna see blue-footed boobies. You're going to see um, all of the main wildlife no matter which one you choose, just make sure you choose one right away because we sell out very quickly. And you can see from this itinerary here that it is absolutely busy. You are gonna be very busy going on and off the ship, twice daily, different stops. And with our cruise tours, you do a two night pre in Quito, the, the seven night cruise, one night post in uh, Quito, or you can do an 11 night itinerary as well. And uh, some of the things that you're gonna see, you're gonna roam with tortoises um, like you saw there. You're gonna have these amazing meals on board, barbecues. Here's the 11 night, uh, which has two nights pre and two nights post, but why not go for the real big trip? You deserve it. Let's do Machu Picchu, and that is 16 nights. It includes a two night pre in Quito, seven night Galapagos cruise, two nights in Lima, two nights in Sacred Valley, two nights in Cusco, and then a night in Lima as you depart. So ladies and gentlemen, you wanna spoil yourself. We have specials for our loyalty guests. We have specials on flights. So there is nothing else you need to do is say, I'm gonna to go to Galapagos, it's going to change me, transform me. And uh, I don't know about you, Alan, but I think uh, I'm ready to go to the Galapagos again after talking about it and seeing these pictures. Such a, uh, such a beautiful part of the world to, uh, to visit. So uh, thank you so much to, to Brenda and the team for taking us on that tour. Uh, and as you can see, we have the most dedicated, knowledgeable, experienced uh, team uh, across Canada. So uh, thrilled to have them, thrilled to have all of you. We're going to wrap up our presentation now. So we're going to reveal the offer. And we're also going to let you know about our cruise with confidence policy, our new pricing policy. And then last but not least, we uh, have the pleasure of giving away some great prizes as well. So uh, I'm going to bring Brenda back on screen. She's going to tell us about the pricing and then we'll turn it over to Chad. Okay. So um, always included. So as you saw, all of our pricing is always included, which means it includes your Wi-Fi, your tips, and the classic beverage package. But guess what? You can upgrade to Elevate for just $39 Canadian per person per day, or you can upgrade to Indulge for $78 Canadian per person per day. And the difference with that is you get the premium beverage package, and you get onboard credit. So it really is phenomenal. And with the suite class with retreat, you of course get that indulge package plus all the other extras. So I think you should spoil yourself, right, Chad, and get yourself into Elevate, Indulge, or the retreat. But um, whatever you choose to snow with celebrity, it's always included. So tell us about the great promo, Chad. 
Well, listen, uh, we wanted to make sure that we were going to make it worth everybody's while who took some time out of their day today to tune in with us and see what celebrities having to offer and how we're returning to service. But I think that now if we've got you excited about where you want to go, we have to make sure that our show offer is going to be the best offer that you can get your hands on, uh, regardless of how you go shopping. So this exclusive uh, cruise show offer with our partners from Expedia Cruises is going to give everybody's booking the following. You are going to get that classic unlimited beverage package that Brenda had mentioned. Everybody is going to get complimentary Wi-Fi for two devices. We are going to prepay your gratuities. And then regardless of how you're making this booking, we're going to make sure that we top up your booking with $350 USD onboard credit to spend on board for things like shore excursions or spa or whatever you like. We're going to make sure you've got lots of spending money with us. One thing I also want to mention, there was lots of slides today that showed example pricing of how much cheaper the exclusive Expedia rates, we showed a lot in Canadian dollars today. There's certainly USD rates available as well. But the Expedia rates on a huge portion of our cruises are much better than even what the celebrity website is quoting. And this show offer can combine with those Expedia rates. So this is going to run for uh, until April the 2nd. This is for new bookings only. Your Expedia Cruises consultant can run you through uh, the offer. They can help hold and confirm your booking and your space for you. And this is the show offer of show offers. It's the best offer we've had this year. And the best news, we know a lot of you are holding future cruise certificates. Those are allowed to be used and combined with the show offer as well. And ladies and gentlemen, one other thing that I think is really important to cover with you today is that we know that it's been a very uncertain time. We know you've watched the travel industry kind of come to a halt. And we know you've got questions and concerns before you get busy planning. So we have created a policy that fits for uncertain times. And we've called it Cruise with Confidence. And it's exactly that. Cruise with Confidence was designed to make sure if you feel a bit uncertain about going ahead and making that booking, we're going to give you all the reasons in this policy why it's absolutely okay to go ahead. Cruise with Confidence will allow you to cancel for any reason and receive 100% of your money back as a future cruise credit. So this is extended until making bookings until May 31st of 2021, but we don't want you to wait that long because you don't want to miss the show offer. But this will be in place for you for these new bookings. So whatever the reason is, you don't need a specific reason. If you just want to cancel, you have the peace of mind, you're not going to lose any money for doing that, and 100% of your money will go back into a future cruise credit for you to use with the future. The second thing that we hear a lot of is, what if the cruise line maybe lowers the rate on what I book and I get penalized for booking early? We never want you in that situation. As part of this great policy, we've built in something called the best price guarantee, and this will allow you to make sure that you get the best price and best promo attached to your booking. And you can change that or let us know all the way up until 48 hours prior to sailing if something comes out that there's a lower rate later and we will adjust it for you. There's never been a policy like this in the cruise industry, but we have created it because it's fitting right now to get this industry moving again, to get everybody the ability to be back on our ships. And in order to do that, you have to feel comfortable with moving ahead. So we've got the best show offer of the year, and now we've got the best protection policy in the industry. We hope that keeps you confident. And Alan, I think we've got some prizing to give away. We have some prizing to do. I didn't, I didn't know that was a verb, but yes. 
Um, so I also want to mention thanks again to the team. Uh, I love doing this as a group uh, from across Canada. And of course, uh, all of the uh, guests that are watching from the U.S., we mentioned uh, pricing is available in Canadian and U.S. dollars. We've also added the exclusive offer in the uh, chat box. You may have seen it pop up. So feel free to go to that link and, and check out the details of our offer. But we're uh, thrilled to be talking about our, our ship sailing again. Uh, we know, as we mentioned uh, several times, there are a few hurdles still to overcome here in Canada, but, but definitely time to start booking, time to start dreaming and planning for your next vacation to take advantage uh, of the space available and this amazing promotion. So reach out to your Expedia uh, travel advisor. Uh, they have lots of uh, great information. And again, we'll give them the most updated information with regards to our return to service, our health and safety protocols, and anything else related uh, to cruising. Uh, I did want to mention as well, we had over 200 questions, so a very engaging group. We're going to continue to monitor that question and answer box uh, for a few more minutes. But again, if you have any questions, reach out to your travel advisors. They'll be uh, happy to assist you. Okay, without further ado, we're going to wrap it up here. Before we do that, um, we have a, a prize, a $500 celebrity cruise voucher. Sandra. That's right. It's my favorite part, everyone. We get to give away some money, and we are giving away a $500 celebrity cruise voucher. Uh, so if you win, all you have to do is reach out to your travel consultant, and then we'll get that applied to a future celebrity booking for you. So we have put the attendees, the clients that have attended this event live, into a random name generator. Drum roll, please. The winner of the $500 voucher is Judith Yee. Congratulations, Yay. Judith. Yay. Now, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say right now that I think we should give away a second $500 cruise voucher. What do you think, Alan? Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> let's do it. All right. Into the random name generator. All right, the winner is Brian Conroy. Brian Conroy, congratulations. Yeah. Congratulations, right. Brian. Amen. Okay, so on behalf of uh, our entire team here in Canada, I, I know we have some guests in the U.S. Thanks for joining us. Time to book your cruise for our Canadians. Thank you all. Uh, we are sailing again very soon, as safely as possible. We appreciate your time today, and please reach out to your Expedia travel advisor as soon as possible to get yourself dreaming and booked again. Thank you all. Thank you. Bye, everybody. Thank you. Cheers. Thanks, Thanks for, for joining, joining us. us.